brothers my sisters let me ask you this question when you see something like what we just saw in the video what comes to your mind what really goes through your mind if you see a man of god walking on people on, on, on pieces of cloth and uh, his members are throwing themselves on his feet. What really comes to your mind? What really comes to your mind? And uh, should this be something that we do? Should this be something that we practiced? Should it? Are Christians Worshipping God or worshipping a man of God. Which is it? Can someone educate me on this? Because I have came across many videos where people have turned their man of God into God. They now worship him. They now do whatever he says. They would rule on the ground for the man of God to walk on them. They participate in the man of God's fraud, miracles, or play. And all these things, when you see them, you ask yourself, what is going on? What is going on? Are people this stupid? Are humans? this naive what has happened to their reasoning faculty you know the thing that pained me the most is that uh, some of them are highly educated people you know they went to school they study they have certificate to prove that but you'll be shocked to see them behaving like this in front of a man of god you'll be shocked that when they get to church or when they, when they get in front of their man of God, all their education just goes away. Like their brain becomes blank. And you see them behaving in such despicable manner. And worst of them all is the man of God. Worst of them all is the man of God. Because he takes pleasure seeing people ruling on his feet. He takes pleasure in that. He is so happy when people rule on his feet. When people worship him, he's so happy. Because if he doesn't want them to do things like this, if he is really someone who believes that people should not worship any other God except God in heaven, worship any other being but God in heaven, he will stop them from doing things like that. He will educate them as to the reason why they should not do things like that. But the fact that you see those members doing all this, it only goes to show that the man of God himself has encouraged actions like this. And that is why the people, the followers, the members are doing it. 
That is the reason why. The men of God, some of them, obviously, are so shameless. They are really, really shameless because they have cornered their Christian. They have brainwashed their Christian. They have turned them into entities that one cannot even recognize anymore. The court-like situation that is going on in the Christendom is something that is worth our collective concern. People should be concerned about this. People should be concerned about this. And I know that the government don't want to get involved in this because they have been a failure to the people and that is why the people have turned to men of God who are also taking advantage of them. I know the government don't want to get involved in this because as far as the government is concerned, let the people be busy with something like that so that the, men of the, the government, the politicians can do whatever they want to do without anyone holding them accountable. That is why you never see the government get involved and try to put things in order. No, they won't get involved. Let the, let, let, let the people busy themselves with religion. Why we, the politicians, why we, why we, the government officials, get away with whatever we are doing? It's really sad. It's really, really sad. But you guys out there, let me hear your take in the comment section below. When you see people, Christian, fellow brothers and sisters, doing this in front of a man of God, what is your take? Do you think it's okay for them to be doing this? Or do you think that something needs to be done to address this problem? If you think it is a problem. Anyway, share your thought and opinion with us in the comment section below. Because I always will love hearing what you have to say. And also, don't forget to like this video, share it, subscribe to the channel because that helps us a lot. And we shall forever be grateful to you.